welcome to my vlog. I'm just gonna set it here. So a few days ago, merong, I had a memory pop up in my Facebook about, and it's just like a one minute video, but I had a really bad sunburn. And this was during, because of my previous job, like before my job right now. So yeah, I was uh, outside the whole day piling lumbers and um, I had to wear safety glasses. So then my sunburn was like so bad. It's like uh, I have I still have glasses and it's all burnt here. So yeah, I'm gonna insert that video and then we'll probably I'm gonna make an upgraded version. We'll talk more about it. Hi friends. Uh, I just want to share something. This week. I have been feeling so down because of my uneven sun sunburn. But it also gave me a sudden realization that we should always work on the beauty that's not fleeting. Like the beauty of our hearts. Because no matter what happens, it will never fade. As what the little prince said in one of my favorite books, The Little Prince. The most essential things in life is not seen by the eyes, but felt with the heart. Have a good weekend, guys! So, ayun, I just find it crazy. I uploaded that on my Facebook three years ago. And I still, I'm still a strong b believer that the most important beauty that we can and we should keep working on is our hearts. Because... Isa sa mga, honestly, isa sa mga pet peeve ko, makamit ng mga tao na they're not so good on the inside. And then, parang outside, hindi rin naman masyadong, ano mo yun, parang hindi rin naman masyadong, ano, josa, whatever. Not josa, but it doesn't necessarily mean na kapag ka hindi ka maganda, wala ka na rin karapatang maging pangit o gali ah. Pero, I just, I'm just thinking that uh, when, when, when you're not, when you're not in the room, or kung wala ka dun sa, sa harap ng mga taong yun, gusto mo ba na ang pinag-uusapan nila sa'yo is, alam mo tong si ano, parang ganito yung ang, ang syongit ng ugali, parang isa sa mga, I'm so guilty, kasi ako talaga pag, Pag nakakita ko ng taong ganun, parang gigil na gigil ako. Pag kunikento ko siya sa ibang tao, parang ang sinasabi ko, grabe, ang showmate na nga niya, tapos yung ugali pa, ang showmate pa. Parang pag hindi ka na masyadong magandahan, sabi ko, parang sinasabi ko na, kung ako hindi ako masyadong maganda, well, hindi naman, uh, whatever, gagandahan ko na yung ugali ko. Parang gusto ko lang i-make sure na, alam mo yun, somehow may maganda naman sa akin. Diba? Hindi yung pangit pa sa labas, pangit pa sa loob, joke, I'm so mean, but, but, I super agree with that. Lalo na ngayon na actually, papasok ko yung insecurities. This is the uh, year, maybe since last year, where I gained the most weight. And alam mo yun, alam mo yung parang sa, I think this is a toxic Filipino culture, pero it's so easy for us and it's like our normal to actually tell people, oh, instead of asking, how are you? Kamusta ka na? So, Ang taba mo na. And you know how much it Parang, I've never realized, and and honestly, I was that person before. To ganun din ako yung, parang, kasi nga, it's a norm eh, in the Filipino culture na parang, instead na batiin mo yung tao, diba, parang, na, oh, kamusta na, parang, ang sabihin mo, ang mapansin mo agad yung weight niya, parang, parang, I was like that before too, until I was in the situation na ako yung tumaba, na, na, alam mo yun, nakakababa din pala ng self-esteem, na every time, kahit saan ka pumunta, party, groceries, sasabihin sa'yo na, ang taba mo na, blah, blah, blah. parang hindi pala siya talaga. Diba, ang daming mga si Solen, ang daming mga artista na nagkukot na it's not nice to say. And I realized, nung ako na nga na sitwasyon na yun, na it's hindi nga pala talaga. Which, which, babalik na naman tayo din sa topic na sinabi ko dito sa video na, everything you have is fleeting. Parang when it comes to your physical Kung, kung maganda ka, kung sexy ka, it can, pwede siyang mawala anytime sa'yo. Pero, if, if your heart 
is is really beautiful. Parang kung kung yung tunay mong ganda is nasa puso mo, kahit kailan, it's not hindi yun mawawala. It's it's gonna be with you forever. So I think I think yeah, that's that's just what I want to talk about in this video that like really at the end of the day that's that's what matters that's what's truly important the beauty of our hearts parang kahit pa gano ka pa maging kataba gano ka maging kaitim ka whatever na alam mo yun na na flaws mo and imperfections it doesn't matter as long as you keep working on the beauty of your heart parang and it's a process. I think I'm not saying that I'm perfect. When I say this, I'm also like talking to myself. Na I always have to constantly remind myself to do everything in love. Like honestly, my personality. I'm really frank. And may mga bagay na hindi ko siya. Minsan mas gusto ko sabihin yun totoo kesa uh, to do everything with love. And it's still a process for me too. Kasi nga Dati, lalo na dati, sobrang ganun ako na, alam mo yun, parang wala akong pakialam sa nararamdaman ng iba. Basta nasabi ko yung totoo. But now I realize that the greatest thing in the world is love. And it doesn't matter. You can you can say the right things, pero if you're not doing it with love, and if you're just hurting the person, you know, para lang to get your point across, then it's not, it's not really good, you know. It's, it's, it's nice to be right, but I think the greatest thing in the world at the end of the day is love. So yeah, like what I said in the in the video that I'm gonna put that I put here. So yeah, I hope that you guys will have a great, great weekend and that as we grow older and we mature every single day or every year, we learn to know what's truly important in life and i wish you all the best guys love you